Hello, I'm Nicolas Sekaki, and I'm the Kindra Global Practice Leader on Application Data and AI. Hello, I'm Gary Green, and I'm the Senior Vice President of Strategic Partnerships at Fiverr. So, Nicholas, can you give us a quick overview of the application data and AI practices and how it fits into Kindrel's overall approach to, you know, your distinguished customer service? Yes, Gary. We provide end-to-end -end services. We consult, modernize, migrate, secure, and manage critical business applications and their data. We enable business inside a scale with the right data foundation, data modernization, and data platform. We want to bring the best experience to our customer. And to do so, we are constantly investing in skills, asset and toolings, the relevant ecosystem of partners, and delivery excellence. And you, Gary, can you share a little about Clouder's vision and mission for hybrid data cloud? Yeah, absolutely, Nicholas. It's a great question. It's very simple. We want to make data and analytics easy and accessible for everyone. Over the last two years, I think everybody is seeing that there's been an explosion of data that they are trying to get insights on. The pandemic has really exasperated this. And so typically what companies would do is more and more people ask for access to data, they would constrain that access. They say, no, we can't do that. In today's world where information is so important and the decisions around it, we need to make sure that it's easily accessible to everyone. And what does that mean? Typically, there are customers that have had all their data on-prem in a data center. Many of our customers jointly are moving into the public cloud. But a lot of our customers jointly are saying because of regulations and constraints, they can't do that. They have to be in a hybrid cloud. So our vision, our strategy for our customers into the marketplace and in the partnership that we have with you is how do we enable a hybrid cloud approach for data and analytics so that it doesn't matter where the data is, it just gives you the ability to get access to it quickly, to be able to secure it and manage it, and then most importantly, get the insights to make those decisions that put your company in a competitive advantage. That's our strategy, that's our vision, and that's our mission. And we believe with Kindrel, we can do that even more effectively. That's impressive. So Nicholas, let me just ask you this question. What is it that C-level executives that might not be technically oriented need to know about Kindrel and Cloudera and how we can help them modernize their applications, transform their businesses to take advantage of the data explosion in the hybrid cloud. Look, Gary, in the digital transformation journey, customers are facing two major challenges, modernization of their application landscape and moving to a data-driven enterprise. And this is tightly linked. You know, some people are trying to modernize the application without thinking about modernization of the data and vice versa. An application modernization without a data strategy is like building a house by starting with the walls. Data is a north star to the cloud journey. Together, Cloudera plus Kindrel, we will deliver large scale transformation capabilities to our customers across multiple industry and geography on the data modernization and application modernization on cloud and in hybrid environment, therefore allowing our customers to have business outcome, accelerating time to value and return on investment. So Kindrel, we will provide project-based and managed services framework and tooling for the Cloudera data platform to modernize customers' data landscape. We also have our global team of data management and AI experts they will be participating in Cloudera certification program. More than a hundred of our talent will be certified just this year. And Cloudera will bring its broad solution portfolio around data and analytics. As you can see, Cloud Cloudera and Kindrel, we have a rich complementary portfolio of services and product. We are developing the best of breeds offering, enabling our client mission critical hybrid cloud, multi-cloud and edge computing data initiatives comes to life. So Gary, 
How will the Kindria plus Cladera alliance lead to new capabilities and business growth for both parties? Well, you know, just, you know, coming on top of what you have just explained is incredible. And this always gets back to what I talk about intrinsic based partnerships are the most powerful ones where one plus one is three is that there is very little competitive overlap between what you provide from a services delivery offering and what we have from a data and analytics platform. But when we bring those together from the edge to AI, as you have explained, it just becomes that much more valuable to our customers. The thing that makes this so important for us is the things that you were just speaking about, or that a customer is making the decision that A, they want to get off of some of the legacy versions of our older software platform onto CDP and be able to do that, but not do that in a silo, but, but to do that as part of the digital transformation projects that are much bigger and broader is that your help with your service offerings, your expertise with our people can bring that power to the customer quickly to help them do that migration. But more so than just the migration itself, what's really important is that the application workloads that the customer is going to run on CDP in an enterprise hybrid data cloud, and that your ability to have the tools and the assets and the people that can quickly make help them make the decisions on how to refactor those applications to get there quickly. That's going to be just so important. The things that you talk about, what you're investing in and what we're investing in, the innovation center that we're going to put together jointly to deliver this, the programs, the people, the training, is that those investments that you're making alongside of us are just going to make sure that the team of people that we deliver together brings confidence in front of the customer that they know that as they take this on path, that they can feel confident that both Kindrel and Cloudera will be trusted partners from the beginning to the end to help them get where they need to be to get access to that data quickly. It doesn't matter if it's coming from the edge. It doesn't matter if they need to apply machine learning and artificial intelligence to it. It just means that they'll get the insights they need quicker than they could do on their own. And this, to me, is a, what's so exciting about how we come together in this partnership in front of the customers. You know, and just, you know, a final question for you, Nicholas, here is uh, how will Kindle, in your mind, and Cloudera, the alliance lead to new capabilities and business growth for both parties? Because we need to make sure, as companies, as we partner together, it's an accretive business, something that is good for both of us, because we need to be able to grow this in a manner that we can not only sustain it, but we can actually take to new offerings into the marketplace over time. What are some of your thoughts around that? Look, as you say, Kendra, we, we became an independent company. And as I said, partnership and the relevant ecosystem is critical for us. You have seen our announcement, by the way, with some of the hyperscalers, Microsoft, AWS, GCP, and, you know, bringing Cloudera into our portfolio in, the, in, in terms of capabilities. We're building up on this partnership and we're scaling it to bring new innovation to the customers. And this joint innovation centers is putting the customer at the center of you know, what we need to do, bringing capabilities, bringing team together, your team, our team into perspective about how we transform the data landscape, how we help customers in their journey defining the journey and then being able to build the highway so they can have optimization of their time and being able to focus on business outcome, not on infrastructure, not on application. As you said, getting the data they need, making sure that the device is available, is reliable from their applications. That's what we are absolutely eager to provide to the team. So I think, look, we are making progress by partners together, joining new offerings, getting in front of the customers and solving their business issues. That's great, Nicholas, it really is. And it just is exciting when I, every time we speak together, because we're just so naturally aligned on what we're, our goals are as two companies into the market for the customer. Great. 
So if, if, if there's just one last final thing that I can just say, kind of wrap up here, um, is that you made an interesting point. Um, and when I speak to my peers in industry, because I sit on some other partner advisory councils, and I've been in this, you know, partner leadership role for 20 plus years, the power of three is so much more important than just the power of two. And what I mean by that, the power of our partnership, what I keep talking about, this intrinsic partnership of one plus one equals three just between the two of us. But if we can bring a third partner together and we can pull that off, that even becomes that much more powerful. And with the hyperscalers that you have built these new partnerships with, that we have now for the last several years built these partnerships, come together with them in front of the customer, identify the workloads that those customers want to get over into the hyperscalers public cloud, and be able to jointly be able to solve that challenge both financially and technically, and do it as quick as possible, and be able to drive the business outcomes that you're talking about, where the customer is no longer focused on the infrastructure. They're focused on the application and the data that they want. I mean, that is incredible. And I think the challenge in front of us is now, as we build out our two-way partnership, is let's go and figure out how we then leverage the hyperscalers to bring them in where applicable with the customer to be able to really bring that multi-level partnership and the power of that into the market. I think it's super exciting. I'm, I'm looking forward for it. I know we've built a pipeline of opportunities to go after and the challenges to the teams is let's go make it happen quickly. Exactly. So Nicholas, thank you so much um, from Cloudera for your executive level support, the partnership here. Um, we really appreciate it. Um, we're looking forward to the next time we can kind of have this chat and talk about some of the customer success. The win. Yep. And Gary, I would like to thank you because at the end of the day, especially when you're in a services company, you know, skills is important. And skills is about human, men and women that makes this transformation happen and the value. And I think that the relationship we have established between the two of us, but also as a two companies and in the ground between the services company you have and the professional services is, is critical. And obviously we are also certifying on the hyperscaler and having also the skills and the partnership with the others. And we're going to bring all these teams together to serve better our customers. So thank you for this partnership and eager for celebrating success. Really appreciate it. Thank you very much and look forward to the next time we have an opportunity to chat. Thanks. Thank you very much.